Only thing more viral than coronavirus this year are videos on TikTok. So how can you and I go viral on TikTok? Let's talk about it. Hey, welcome to Marketing This Week. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button below this video so that you can stay up to date with the latest and greatest in marketing as we upload these videos you know, weekly and we let you know what's going on so you can keep the edge and stay focused on your marketing and growing your business. While you're down there, hit the like button so the YouTube algorithm knows that we're creating great content day in and day out and they allow more people to see our videos so we can help more people know what's going on in the world of marketing. We're very grateful that you're here and today we're talking about TikTok. But first, let's get a little bit of the updates out of the way. Facebook and Instagram have made a few new updates and they've been making a ton of updates lately if you haven't noticed. But new on Facebook and Instagram. On Instagram, you can now age gate specific posts, meaning you can set a specific age for specific posts so that not everybody can see your post if they're not above a certain age. That's a pretty cool tool if your product is something that's not meant for children or, or people under a certain age. Moving on, the Messenger app that's kind of part of Facebook and integrated with Facebook is now going to work for Instagram as well, which is a big deal. It makes things a lot cleaner and easier if you use both Facebook and Instagram. You want to keep all your messaging in the same place as a business owner. I totally understand. So that's a pretty cool update as well. And finally, the latest update on Facebook is watch is now topical. That means you can search for specific videos on watch based on topic. You could say, I like the topic business and marketing and see only the business and marketing videos on your watch page on Facebook. So that's pretty cool. It can allow more people to get discovered on watch and it can allow you know your brand to really build a, a, a topic spot for itself on Facebook itself. So that's pretty cool and you could get discovered by more users. I'm going to talk about how to go viral on TikTok, but first, there's this huge problem going on when it comes to Christmas packages and when it comes to shipping specifically. So if you have an e-commerce business where you ship physical products, this could be a huge update that you need to pay attention to, okay? So the problem is that we're shipping more packages than ever before. Places like FedEx and USPS are starting to fall behind, okay? So that means if someone orders something in December, they may not get it till January, which is after Christmas. So if you're an e-commerce business, and you're trying to avoid people receiving their Christmas presents in January and February, then this is very important, right? It's part of creating a great customer experience to be able to get their packages to them on time. So what can you do? Let's be, let's be solutions oriented here. Let's not dwell on the problem. I mean, it was bound to happen. More people are home than ever before. People don't like to go shopping and packages are being ordered hot in higher numbers than ever before. So here's some things you can do. You can consider charging more, right? Raising your prices or charging for shipping, which it might that might sound extreme, but it might get, help you get your packages where they need to be on time because you can pay the, the premium prices to get the two-day shipping. You can also think about leaning on Amazon's multi-channel fulfillment. It's pretty much impossible to beat Amazon's warehousing network and proximity or closeness to your customer is more important than ever before this year because we're, we're trying to get packages out on time, right? So think about using Amazon's uh, multi-channel fulfillment for website orders and that can actually change the game and help you get your packages to your customers on time. And finally, just don't rely on services like FedEx or Smart Post or UPS Mail innovations after December 1st, okay? It's going to be a wild ride this holiday season, so buckle up because you don't want to assume that's what works before is going to work now because everything has changed. How are you tackling your shipping problems? Comment below. Let us know if you have any tips or tricks around that for the other folks in e-commerce that need to get their products in the hands of their customers for Christmas. Let us know if you have any tips or tricks. Just comment below and let's open the conversation so that we can help people out. So huge news, this just in, the United States of America is suing Google, okay? So they're suing Google for antitrust laws. They believe that Google is creating a monopoly and making it harder for other small businesses to be found on the internet. So the US is going through with a lawsuit against Google. Now moving on to TikTok, TikTok's head of marketing gave out some advice to brands that are trying to go viral. Ever since Ocean Spray nailed it when this random guy 
made this random video on TikTok right here. Ocean Spray capitalized by sending him a bunch of free merch and free Ocean Spray. And now people are wondering, how can I make a video for my brand that goes viral just like Ocean Spray did? But if you look closely and you notice, Ocean Spray did not create this on purpose, okay? Somebody decided to make this video on TikTok and it was a real authentic user that uses the app all the time and he made a single video that for some reason blew up and all it was was him skateboarding and drinking some ocean spray. For all we know, on a different day, it could have been Gatorade or it could have been some other brand, right? But today, that day, that video, it was ocean spray that he was drinking. So, ocean spray didn't create this from scratch. They didn't even have any idea it was going to happen. They just waited until it happened and then capitalized on it like a good brand marketer would do. So Katie from TikTok says that you should look at the first 10 posts in your TikTok app to get a feel for what the community is doing, what kind of trends are going on, what are people talking about, read the comments, try to get a, an overall underlying feel for the community so that you can then come in and create original content that nobody's seen before and that has to do with how people are reacting to the world around them, the types of videos that are working right now, and how people are talking to each other and really what's getting the most attention and really Katie went on to say you can't plan to go viral it just doesn't work like that nobody uploads a TikTok video and says now I'm gonna go viral I mean some people do but that doesn't mean that it will work right just like the ocean spray guy who never expected to go viral is now one of the biggest TikTok stars there is you and I can't depend on the same thing happening. So really what we should do instead is to build a smart marketing strategy that involves keeping our thumb on what is going on inside of TikTok world, right? If we can understand the community of people on TikTok, then we can insert an, an original video, some original content that people haven't seen before, and it may or may not go absolutely viral and change our brand forever. So don't get caught up chasing trends. Instead, focus on what makes your brand special. Keep your finger on the pulse of the community and work things out from there. Try to create great content. Don't try to create viral content. And if you don't already have a kick-ass marketing strategy in your business, we're giving away free marketing strategy workshops. We used to charge $2,000 for them today. We're giving them away for free for a limited time only. All you have to do is click the link in the description below this video and we'll let you have a free workshop with four plus videos, tons of worksheets, and you can actually message me directly inside the workshop and I can help you come up with a marketing strategy that outlasts, outwit, and outplays your competitors in your market space. This is something really powerful for anybody looking to grow their brand or just get more leads or get more sales and grow their overall revenue right this is the growth machine that we use when we go work with other businesses we lay down a marketing strategy that absolutely changes the game for each business we work with so go ahead and click the link in the description of this video and do it now before it's too late and that's this week in marketing again my name is Ryan Kearns if you didn't already hit the subscribe button below so you know when we upload our next video and hit the like button so YouTube knows that we have awesome content and we'll continue to get views and help more people with their marketing and growing their business. Thanks a lot. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.